What is up everybody? It's Fink here. And today is another great Zer Day. Oh, come on guys. You guys don't know what Zer Day is? Alright, alright. Today's Friday. And if anybody knows anything about Fridays in the game of Destiny, Zer has showed his ugly face back at the tower. And I'm going to show you where he is and what kind of awesome shit he has. Now, let's see here. He is down to the right. As soon as you spawn into the tower, you're going to take an immediate right turn. And we're going to start heading down to the hangar. Because uh, Zert is actually down in the bar getting his drink on. Uh, I mean, with a face like his, a face that only a mother can love. He's down there getting his drink on, trust me. Now, as soon as you go down to the hangar, you want to take a left. Go all the way down the stairs and right into the bar, and he's in the very back. God. Now, this week, he is selling the exotic boost to the Titan MK44 stand aside. Carry more heavy ammo weapons. Not more heavy ammo. Yeah, there we go. More heavy ammo. Increase the duration of shoulder charge. So, people who use the shoulder charge in PvP, you are going to love this because you can run way farther and smash into people. Now, for the hunter, don't touch me. Now, guys, this is one of the other exotics that I have not seen. It is, it's pretty, for me, it's like more of a rarer exotic. Now, taking damage from a melee attack makes you briefly invisible. This is an awesome effect, considering the fact that if you do Crota's End Raid and you get meleeed by a Thaw, you become invisible, you can just keep on going. They don't see you, you can get ahead of them. It would make it more possible to solo the lamps for people who haven't been able to do it yet. Increase low reload speed with special weapons. Increase super energy gained from killing minions of the darkness. These are these are great, great, great power-ups. Starfire Protocol. Gain additional fusion grenade. Carry more ammo for fusion rifles and carry more ammo for heavy weapons. Now for a warlock, this is an awesome chest piece. If you haven't gotten the chest piece from the raid yet, I would suggest using this one, considering that your boots are to give you heavy ammo, and now you have a chest piece that gives you even more heavy ammo. So people who use the Galva horn, you have more shots with it now. You can just go around freaking spraying and praying with the rocket launcher. Speaking of rocket launchers, the Dragon's Breath. This launcher can hold three shells rounds fired from this weapon leave a solar flare upon detonation that's an awesome rocket launcher it just looks badass i know i haven't gotten it from a chest or a drop so i will be picking up one of these for sure today and look at that the exotic engrams for gauntlets are back so whoever didn't pick up the rune wings or anything from the Titan or any other specific gauntlet set, you have a chance to get in again today. And of course, the exotic shard. And now our daily, our Friday up, I want to say daily upgrades, but it's every Friday upgrades. The knucklehead radar armor, which is awesome. The Akphalage symbiote. Chest of the Loopy for the Titan. The Armentarium. Apothesis Veil, Heart of the Praxic Fire, which I've never seen this, I've never actually seen this chess piece. The Last Word, Universal Remote, Pocket Infinity, Patience and Time, Thunderlord, and the upgrade for the Galvhorn. Now our, our telemetries today are Auto Rifle Telemetry, Hand Cannon Telemetry, Fusion Rifle Telemetry, Plasma Drive, and Emerald Coil. Seeing how stacked this inventory actually is this time, this is like a fucking Guardian's wet dream right now. You have a you have a great piece for each Guardian. And who knows, there might be some Guardians out there for that have a Titan that they've gotten every piece of raid armor except the boots and now they're set up. So, that, that is just going to be amazing. 
Now, what do you guys think of his inventory today? Because, I mean, he is just stacked. I mean, make sure you leave it in the comments. Tell me what you think. If this is your first time stopping by, make sure you subscribe and take at least two seconds to hit that like button. And I'll see you guys Tuesday.